Mosalihi has graduated more than 30 PhD students. But the first one that used to always tell us, you have to work hard and smart. So if you try to rely on being smart alone, it's not going to take you far. You have to work both hard and smart. And I took that to heart and I communicate the same message to my own students as well. Uh, he taught us also how to pursue excellence. Not simply finish a task, try to do it so that you are feeling proud of that product after it is done. Uh, I also observed how he cares for his students, not only in the classroom, outside the classroom, and beyond graduation. It's a lifelong care until today. And finally, how to conduct all of that excellence in an ethical and professional Accomplishments, we thought that we would group them into a number of categories or branches uh, to follow the tree analogy. Uh, one is the graduate student mentoring, and this is one branch that continues to work. So if we consider all the uh, PhD students of Dr. Mosel and their PhDs, and the PhDs of their PhDs, we could be in the hundreds. Uh, actually, he is my mentor. He is my role model, actually. The one that I learned my skills from. And I still, until now, uh, utilize these skills. I learned all my academic career, actually, is due to his, uh, let's say, what he instilled in me while I'm doing my PhD. His 40 years of experience, he translated that to all his students, including myself. I did uh, really enjoy the mentor mentorship he provided, and I think uh, I need two lifetimes to thank him for all what he did uh, for me and for my career. would be difficult to say about Dr. Muselli, um, but um, he's always been a great inspiration and made those years at Concordia a very enjoyable time. I did learn a lot from him. Um, commitment, hard work, how to, uh, you know, encourage and inspire, and inspire my students to work hard in their research. And again, it did influence my research, um, let's say, experience. The introduction of my story was also written by a number of individuals here in this room, others who could not be with us tonight and uh, think, I think of that very high and reflect on it. So I do thank you all very much. This is a great honor for me and for my family. I do thank you once again.